Hey, Fuzz Pie Guy here. I'm going to show you how to install Mode S Mixer 2 on the Raspberry Pi. So the first thing you'll need to do is go to the following website here. And once you're there, you can just scroll down to Mode S Mixer 2 and hit download. Then we need to scroll down and depending on what image you're using, you'll have to click on the one that you're using and the pie that you're using so we're just going to click the first one here and it'll come up and we're just going to download it Alright, so once that's downloaded, which I believe it is, we're just going to come over here to a program called WinSCP. And this is a great program for copying files to and from the Raspberry Pi. So on your left side is your computer, on the right side is the Pi once you're connected. So we're just going to go to download and scroll down until we find it here. And we're just going to drag it over. Now actually that should be it. So what we can do now is <coughs> It's on the Pi. So what we can do is we have to install it. So we can install it here. All right. And that is it. So all we have to do now is put in the command for the Pi, I mean for the uh, mixer to work. Now, let's see if I can do this. clear that so as you can see you have to start the mode mixer then we'll gr we're going to in connect to the pie itself so I got to change the IP address of this then we're going to see if we can do both but I gotta check my port number here so bear with me here so alright so once you uh, ran the uh, command here to install it we need to run the program so what we need to do is is we need to do an in connect and stuff so what I'm going to do is I'm going to back this up and change the port to 30105 then I got to change this to the uh, pi that I'm running uh, ADS-B on. <clears throat> then what you can do after that, you can do a dash dash location, then put in your coordinates 
then you know whatever it may be then hit enter so I'm going to pause this and run mine all right so once you run it you'll just need to go to the uh, IP address of your pod and uh, put the port number in and it should come up now the map shows this so you may have to get a uh, API key for Google and pay for it or you just deal with it or there may be a way that we can change it to uh, Bing maps or whatnot but either way you could still use this for a lot of stuff click on flights charts <clears throat> and all that uh, stats what you're tracking up here time and there's a lot of other things that you can do with uh, with this other than just this. You can add all different types of uh, other inputs that you can do. So, but this is just a generic overall how to uh, uh, get your stuff up and working. So, they really did a good upgrade on this compared to what it was a year or two ago so it's just the issues with Google wanting to be difficult so but uh, but that's it so thanks for watching and stay tuned I'll uh, put a link in the description to my website of the uh, commands and all so uh, this won't work on a Raspberry Pi Zero so it'll work on uh, a 2, a 3 and like a B plus and that's it so and other obviously devices other than the Pi so but it doesn't work on the uh, the uh, Raspberry Pi Zero. So, alright, thanks for watching.